Good morning, welcome to your Wednesday, December 20th, Daily Operations Weather Briefing. Currently across the region, we do have a cold front that uh, moved through earlier this morning um, with the 12Z surface analysis that will be coming out. This should be a little bit farther south. This front will actually be stalling over the Carolinas, right around uh, Cape Hatteras, if not just a little bit farther south of that area. And we'll have several weak impulses right along that boundary providing some scattered showers for the tidewater region and down into the Carolinas. Here at Wallops looks like we'll remain dry but can't rule out the slight chance we do have some light drizzle that could possibly make its way uh, far enough north uh, just after the noontime hour and through about four o'clock but overall it should remain dry under mostly cloudy skies today. Current satellite radar imagery, we do have some light precip off to our south and west, and that'll continue throughout the day today. Uh, again, pushing a little bit farther south as we go throughout this morning to the afternoon. But then again, we could see just some slight pockets of, uh, or light pockets of drizzle move over the area this afternoon. And you can see temperatures have been jumping all around in the mid 40s to the lower 50s. And for the most part today, they should be hovering in the lower 50s for daytime highs. As of 8 a.m. this morning, we do have a scattered layer at 12,000 feet, broken at 20,000, broken at 25,000, northwesterly wind at six knots with a temperature of 51 degrees. Over the next 24 hours, we'll be green across the board for our hazards. And again, between noon and four o'clock this afternoon, do have a slight chance of drizzle, but that's really only about a 10% chance uh, uh, for today. Overall, mostly cloudy with a high temperature of 54 degrees today. Winds will top out of, out of a northwesterly direction at about 8 to 13 knots. And that will occur uh, after 12 p.m. this afternoon and carry through about like through 3 o'clock. And then winds will decrease out of the northwest to 5 to 10 knots. We'll have light north to northeasterly winds during the overnight hours and temperatures dropping down into the mid-30s to lower 30s closer to daybreak tomorrow. We'll start off mostly cloudy, but skies will become partly cloudy throughout the night with that cold front uh, pushing a little bit farther south and that cloud cover, uh, mid to upper level cloud cover that will be predominant over the region uh, moving offshore. As you can see for the overnight low, we'll get down to around 31 degrees, which is seasonable for this time of year. And as we look at the TAF forecast, we'll be VFR throughout the day today with ceilings mainly between 20 and 25,000 feet could see some ceilings also around the 15,000 foot level. Our tides this morning are normal and over the next several days Thursday partly cloudy and cooler with high pressure building into the region while behind 44 degrees and then clouds will increase Thursday night into Friday as that front begins to push back north as a warm front. We'll get uh, unseasonably warm on Friday. We'll get up to high around 56 degrees and we do have a chance with that warm front moving through the area that we do see a, a chance for a light shower during the later portions of the afternoon and into the evening hours. Well, that conclude the daily operations weather briefing for today. We'll be back at 10 a.m. for your extended outlook. Have a great day.